I'm here in the multi-purpose building in Warrensburg, Missouri, where you see a mules faced against SBU Bearcats in their annual blackout game. The blackout game is to show support for the team and our school. Let's take a look at the highlights. The blackout game started with a tip-off from Dylan Deck, giving the Bearcats first possession. The Mules defensive was aggressive, allowing few points per possession. Dylan Deck was a formidable offense force in the paint, along with Charles Hamrick and Dalen Robinson. Nice shot from Charles Hamrick. He always has a good connection to the hoop, really helping his team out. Dylan Deck took a number of fouls in the first half, going three for five at the line. Dylan's a powerful starting center, He's in a great position to pull a lot of mistakes out of the defense to his advantage. Ryan Magjash drops six points outside the arch. Very familiar shot by Ryan. The fans are very used to seeing it. They love it. Supporting points from John Gillum outside the arch. Here to Charles Hamrick again. He's a great option to pass to, super confident with the ball, and he's not afraid to take a chance. The Mules know how to spread the defense out. They really keep the ball moving, and John Gillum is always there on the outside, ready to take the three. Deck scores a layup with an assist from Kyle Wolf. That was a great teamwork between the guys, great layup. Dalen Robinson takes a foul from the Bearcats in a layup. Dalen scored about 11 points in the game, five of them being goals, two of them being outside the arch. Deck scores two points for the Mules in the paint. This has been his territory, definitely something really familiar to him. Defense had a lot of trouble stopping him. Robinson not far behind Deck, scoring two more points in the paint. They're really giving the Bearcats a defense a hard time. At the half, the Mules were up by six. They looked really great coming out on the court. Great teamwork between JT White and Dylan Deck in the second half. TJ White scores a layup, making his total point 17, the highest score for the team. A foul against the Bearcats defense, allowing John Gillum to shoot a free throw. John has really shown his colors this year, really stepping out for the team. He's become a great leader. He's fast and careful with his shots. You can't seem to tie this kid down. Great play by Charles Hamrick, helping the team score two more points in the second half. That was a nice save from Dylan Deck, who assists Ryan Magjash with a three-pointer. That was a great form of teamwork, awesome shot from Ryan. The players really trust each other with the ball, which is a great strength for the Mules basketball team. You can really see it between Dalen Robinson, Preston Bruns, and TJ White. Here comes Robinson again, charging down the court. He runs circles around the Bearcats' defense. You can really see how big communication and just knowing where the other players are for the Mules can really help score some major points for the game. Assist from Dalen Robinson to TJ White puts another two points for the Mules. Assist from Dalen Robinson to TJ White puts another two points for the Mules. Preston Bruns is a great team player. He's always seeing open passes, and this time he helped assist Dylan Deck for another two points for the Mules. In the final minutes of the game, Charles Hamrick puts another two points on the board with a layup. I'm here with TJ White, UCM Mules player. TJ, how are you doing today? I'm good, and you? I'm doing awesome. Despite all the snow and the cold, there were so many people here today in the stadium dressed in all black to come support you guys. How does that feel as a team? Well, it feels good that we have so many supporters and people that come out to watch us and like watching us play. What do you guys think about today's turnout? How did you guys think that you guys played? Uh, we played very good on defense and I think we played pretty well. We came out with the win so we can't complain. Right, you really can't, can you? Um, this is your 10th straight win against the Bearcats. How does that feel as a team? What did you guys work on to make it have a 10? Oh, we just taking it one game at a time. We didn't even, coach didn't even tell us that. So we just, I mean, that's good in history. So I'm glad we could do that. That's keep incredible, mm -hmm. that's incredible. Is there any last comments you'd like to say about the game? Um, I'm just, 
I want to thank all my teammates. We play hard. We'll be ready for the next one. Awesome. Thank you so much, TJ. Reporting for Sports Page, I'm Katie Bailey.